anyone else feel rich when they like pull out cash? <laughs> the cash envelope system makes me feel rich until it's time to spend it and then I'm like... <laughs> Out of here. I went and pulled out cash, you guys, because you guys know that I am back on the cash envelope system because my ass cannot be controlled by swiping. Um, I did have a specific system debit card for my cash envelopes, but I wasn't really paying attention to what I was spending my money on. I just knew I had a certain amount and I was swipe, 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 and I didn't really take care of how much each category would need. And it just kind of made like an aloof situation in my head where I was just like, well, I'll just keep swiping my card until there's nothing in there, right? So, um, no, that's not what we're doing anymore. We are putting myself in a budget because I need to pay off debt. So, I went to go pull out all this cash from my September 3rd paycheck. And we are going to stuff this so I can freaking have savings for the events that are happening in October and to make it to my first paycheck on October 13th. So this is going to take care of me. Now the cool part is that I thought I didn't have um, like a wallet anymore but bitches. I found my I think it's wild or wheeled um, cash envelope card um, wallet. If they are still active and selling this I will link it down below but <laughs> you guys I used to use it that there's still change in here from when I used to use this and I can't remember the last time I used this wallet I feel like it's been a year but um, I already stuck some of my cards in there but what it does have it has so many slots to put your cash in so I have some pre-designated labels already on there because of when I used to save um, use the cash envelope system and all I'm gonna do now is jump right back in it and stuff my cash envelopes for the categories that I have put for my September 3rd paycheck that happened in September 29th. Um, so yeah, let's get to it. Now the only thing that I will say is that in order for me to get to the bank, I had to pump gas. So I pumped half of my gas on there so I only pulled out the other half cash because the other one was just like, I had to go to the gas station, <laughs> literally. I'm actually even starving right now. So I was kind of very disciplined to like go pump gas, get my cash envelopes and come back home to film. Otherwise I would've just gone to the grocery store, there'd been no cash stuff in for any of those categories and I was just like, I can't do that. Plus it's not good to go to the grocery store hungry. So might as well come back, film, eat something and then take my ass to the grocery store so I can have more of a you know a plan to not buy the entire store so um let me flip you guys around and let's get these cash envelope stuff because yes honey we need this cash saved and ready for the month of October okay let's go I'm flipping you I'm flipping you all right don't mind the chaos but <laughs> I went to the bank you guys I did go to the bank so I have my wallet the wild or wheeled wallet I forgot how to pronounce it but I'll link it down below if they're still active okay but here is the cash that I have and um we are gonna go ahead and we are gonna stuff my cash envelopes for the first two weeks of October using my September 3rd paycheck payout which was a magic month which is what I call free money okay girl math it out you guys <laughs> Anywho, so let me pull away the um, my phone. Let me push some of this stuff out there so I can have room to lay out all this cash. Now, I'm not that fancy. I don't have, um, what do you call it, those cash thingies for breaking up your money. It, it, I don't care. But we got, let's see, 100, 200, 300, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 400, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 500, 1, 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 585. Looks like what I pulled out. Let's hope that's right because I need to start um, pulling all of this on here. Now, like I said, the only thing that I don't have fully on me is the gas budget because I had to pump gas before I even made it to the bank because I know my car so well and I know exactly how much to pump to make it in two weeks back and forth from work to home. So, um, yeah, it was payday and I was already like lagging on not um, pumping gas like when I did get paid. So, here we are. Now... As far as how I'm going to go ahead about this, let's put my hundreds in one pile right there. Let's put my twenties 
in another pile. I'm sad that the ATM doesn't give out tens, which is fine. It is what it is. Um, so I have a ton of fives. I wish there was more like bill options, but a girl is not gonna complain. No, we're not. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is um, pull money for groceries. So that's the first thing I need to do after I eat is go to the grocery stores. Now I do have pre-designated like um, slots already for um, my cash envelopes. I think this wallet has one, two, three, four. Four internal slots and you can put um, five and six as externals, okay? So, yeah, it is what it is. So, I do have pre-labeled groceries, gasoline, and spending, and then the rest are blank. So, I'm going to go ahead and do 180 for groceries. So, we're going to do 100, 20, 40, 60, 80. So, this is 180. And that's going to be for groceries. And we're just going to go ahead and put it in the grocery category right up in there. Right up in there. Next, we have gasoline. Now, of course, it does say 60 on here, but I pumped 30 already. So I'm just going to put 30 into that section. So 20, 25, and 30. So next week, when I need to pump gas, I'll have the next half. So, yeah. And with gas prices going up, honestly, 60 for two weeks is now pushing it. Maybe they might have to do like 70 instead in the upcoming like paydays. Um, I gotta go do laundry, so that'll be 30. Got a 20 on here, 25 and 30. And I'm actually gonna put that back over here, so that we're not messing with it. And then Bean needs 55 and that's because she needs litter and food and I'm already doing a huge like restock in my house. So she did get her own budget this time around. And since it was like an extra paycheck that you know, it's just whatever I wanna do with it, I decided that instead of pulling it for my groceries, I'll just add on to it. So I'm gonna put 55 um, into here. So let's do 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, let's see, 2, 4, 45, 50, 55, so I'm going to go ahead and just add that to the grocery category, honestly, and I'm just going to, yeah, I'm just going to add it on, so, so now for groceries, I have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 220, 25, 30, 35. So 235 I have for groceries so I can take care of Bean and myself for the next two weeks. Cool. Now for the miscellaneous category, I kind of don't want this in my wallet, but I'll just put it in there just in case. Um, the only thing I do want in my wallet is the nail savings, but even then that can wait. Um, but yeah. For grandma's birthday, I am just going to go ahead and save 100 And I'm going to go ahead and put that in this blank situation right there. Next, we have Oogie Boogie, and that's going to be 100 And if you're wondering why so, like, if why I'm categorizing, like, $30 to, uh, $200 for Oogie Boogie, it's because $35 just goes straight to parking, food alone, or, like, alcohol is a good chunk of my money and oogie boogie merch might be expensive so it's not a lot um so i'm actually going to put that in the savings with grandma because i'm not touching that next i have my nail savings and that is going to be half which is 90 so that might be the remaining part of the budget because the clothing i kept it in my bank account because i'm going to do online shopping like i said i'm not allowed to go physically into store because i will not be able to control myself if you know your triggers make sure you avoid them at all costs <laughs> so we're going to do two four six eight 85 90 so this is just for half i'm pretty sure i might not need so uh, like so much but just in case and that's going to go in my spending category so 90 is going to go on there and when i get paid again i'll pull the other half and that's going to be for a fill so hopefully it won't be as expensive when i get a new set however i am planning to get more like um nail art and that always goes up a bit 
But anywho, that was literally my cash envelope stuffing. I pulled out everything. So I'm pretty happy. Um, yeah, the only thing I didn't pull was the clothing. And that's because I might be online shopping. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I am now going to eat something and then go to the grocery store and just deal with life. All right. I love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. I'll link everything that I used down below. This planner is an Erin Condren Franken Plan Planner. They don't, they only have this in a 7x9 and, and 8x11, I believe, but I Franken planned an A5 using multiple other products and uncoiling it. All the stickers are from my shop, so Erica Life Vlogs for any sticker related products that you see on my channel. And this wallet is the Wild Cash Envelope wallet and um, I will link their shop down below if they're still active because I did get this like about a year or two ago. Uh, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye you guys. Mm -hmm.